Symantec email security with isolation, award-winning protection in a simple-to-use way. For organizations of all sizes, email is the number one threat vector they need to care about. We see three types of attack. Social engineering, for example, phishing on credential theft, advanced threats, for example, ransomware, and sensitive data being lost by email. The nature of the email threat has changed. We've seen a massive growth in phishing and credential theft attacks, with cyber criminals making use of social engineering to research their perfect attack. This is not an enterprise-only problem. Symantec research shows that users in smaller organizations are twice as likely to receive a malicious email. Because of this changing attack type, organizations need to apply multiple layers of protection. Symantec Email Security makes it simple for a non-expert email administrator to optimize their security policy. The Service Configuration Health View shows a simple representation of where they have strong and weak policies. And looking at this view, it's simple to see what you need to do to improve. Because phishing attacks are complex, let's look at how you can configure your email security solution to guard against different elements. The first protection we want to apply is to ensure that we only send or receive properly authenticated email. And we take advantage of the industry standards around SPF, DMARC and DKIM to do so. A second protection is to guard against fraudulent email. Symantec includes a business email scam analyzer. And in addition, customers can guard against a range of impersonation attacks. They can add all legitimate third party senders to an allow list by simply adding email address, IP address or sender domain. To stop inbound messages hijacking an organization's domain, we recommend that all domains used by an organization are added to the domain impersonation control setting. And thirdly, high value individuals in the organization can have their individual email accounts listed here, and that will guard against lookalike spoofing attacks, for example, where the surname and first name are reversed. To help users identify suspicious email, it's really simple to add a policy to flag all external email. This is really useful where a cyber criminal wants to impersonate an internal email and you want your user to be aware of the risk. As this email opens, you can see it's come from an external source and the nature of the threat. We're increasingly seeing emails that link to unknown websites. We just don't know whether they're good or bad. Here's an example where an email is sent that contains a link to a website. As the user receives it, they see that they're being invited to look on a video, and so they click the link. Instead of being taken to a video, they're taken to a website. And this website could be hosting malicious content in the source code being used to attack the user's browser or infect their device. Symantec includes email threat isolation to prevent against these types of attacks. From the Service Configuration Health dashboard, you can see that we have not enabled the isolation policy. And to fix it is really simple. We simply enable that policy and there are no configuration settings to be made as this is done by the team at Symantec. Now, as the user opens that link, the website is opened in an isolated mode. At this stage, the user may have realized this isn't the video they're expecting. However, if they persisted on this website, there is no risk because the source code has been modified and now the website is just pointed to the isolation service. There is no way for the user to receive any malicious content. Isolation will also guard against phishing attacks. In this example, the user has a link to update and verify their identity. They're taken to a website, but again, this is isolated. And now as the user tries to enter their username and password, they find the website is presented in a read-only view. This stops that user from inadvertently losing their username and password, which could be behind a bigger attack. So there you have it, semantic email security with isolation. 
guarding organizations against impersonation, malicious web links, and phishing attacks.